in this video I want to go over the skills of manipulating decimals. My focus is multiplying and dividing decimals. Okay, so let's start by multiplying two decimals. Okay, so if the question is say 0 0.3 times 0 0.03. So well, <coughs> it's a good uh, skill or it's a good uh, method to change this as a fraction. Say 0.3 is same as 3 tenths and 0 0.03 is 3 out of 100. Okay, now so this decimal has been changed into fraction. So when you're multiplying fractions, you simply multiply the top and the bottom. So this is same as 3 times 3 over 10 times 100. So this is same as 9 out of 1000. And 9 out of 1000 as a decimal is 0 0.09. Okay. So let's check this on a calculator. So this is my simple calculator. So you've got 0 0.3. This is a star key times 0 0.03 which is 0 0.009 and this is how you do without a calculator okay so let me do one example of division now say equation 2 is say the question is say 3 divided by 0 0.3 so here when you're dividing uh, before I show you the next step I want to show you a skill that you can do uh, a skill that you need to understand in division. Say, let me give an example. Say, you know 24 divided by 2 is 12. Okay. So, we know the answer is 12. So, if suppose I change this, I times this by, say, 2. And this becomes 48. And I also times this by 2. So, that is, this is 20. 2 times 2, 2 times 2 is 4. So now if you divide 48 by 4, that will also give you 12. So in division, if you make something bigger, one, this, this is called the divisor, uh, this is called the dividend, the first number bigger by 2 times, and if you make the divisor bigger by 2 times, the answer will be the same. Let me give you one more example say let's take small numbers so you know 6 divided by 3 is 2 6 divided by 3 is 2 so let's make this say 5 times bigger if you make this 5 times bigger so this is 30 and if you make this 5 times bigger this becomes 15 and 30 divided by 2 sorry 30 divided by 15 is also 2 so now I want to make this I want to change this into 3. So what should I multiply this by? So well, 0.3 times 10, 10 times bigger. If I want to make this 10 times bigger, I have to make this also 10 times bigger. So this is same as 30 divided by 3. And 30 divided by 3, you know the answer is 10. So here you can write the answer is 10. So let me show you both 3 divided by 0.3, which would be 10. And I don't need to show you 30 divided by 3 would be 10. But let me show you both so that you believe me or understand. So 3 divided by 0 0.3 equal. That's 10. Or 30 divided by 3. This dash stands for division. That's also 10. Okay. So let's now, question 3, let's move on to again say multiplication so that is 2.356 times 3000 now these are skills you need to do know how to do without a calculator so this is same as 2.356 is same as 2356 out of 1000 and this 3000 i'm going to write as 3 times 1000 over 1. So as I, as I told you, when you're multiplying decimals, you can multiply the top, 
numbers and the bottom numbers. So 2356, 2356 times 3 times 1000 divided by 1000. So it's a good practice to change the whole thing as a fraction. So this 1000 and this 1000 can be cancelled. So what you've got is 2356 times 3. So let's do it without a calculator, 2,356 times 3. So this has become a neat multiplication. So I'm using the algorithm, so 6, six times 3 is 18, remainder 1, 15, 16, remainder 1, 9, 10, remainder 1, 7,068 is the answer. So let's check this. Cancel 2.356 times 3000. The star is th times 7068. So the answer is right. So the answer is 7068. Okay, so what happens? Let me take now division. Question 4 is division. So we want to do 15 divided by 0 0.02. So I want to change this into neat number. I want to change this into 2. So this is 2 is how many times of 0 0.2? Well, that's 100 times. Okay, so let me show you that. Uh, you can check that. 0 0.02 times 100 gives you 2. So if you make this 100 times bigger, this has also to be made 100 times big. Okay, so this is 1,500 divided by 2, which is 750. So this would also be 750. So let me show you both on a calculator. So 15 divided by 0 0.02 equals 750. And 1,500, cancel, 1,500 divide by 2 is also 750. Okay, now let's move on to again division or multiplication. This is a 2.35 times 1.2. So I always like to change the decimals into fractions. So this is 235 out of 100 and this is 12 out of 10. So now you have to just multiply the top numbers. So it's, this is 235 times 12 over 100 times 10. Okay, so I have to do the top multiplication. So let me do the algorithm. I know the top 12 times table. So I'll go 12 times 5 is 66. 12 times 3 is 36 plus 6 is 42 for remainder. 12 times 2 is 24, and 20. 24 plus 4 is 28. So this is 2,820 over 1,000. But this is, this should be 10, yeah. This is 1,000. So I'm going to do this the same as 2,820. Okay, so can I write like this? So this is 2,820. 282 times 10 over 100 times 10. So this 100 gets cancelled. So this is 282 divided by 100, which is 0, 2.82, which is 2.82. So let's confirm this on the calculator. So if you just know how to change the decimals into fractions, you can do any type of multiplication. So 2.35 times 1.2. The answer should be 2.82. 2 so answer is right.